Hey everyone, it's Viv Lay Love Dicky, and today the wedding event is here! Woohoo! From December 3rd to December 9th, you'll be able to earn oaf rings to get these four sets right here. The first one, for the Vow of Love, and the second one, Oath of Flower Rain, are the new sets. Childlike Love and Destined Fate are the old sets from the previous wedding event making us come back. As you can see here, each individual piece has a price, meaning you can purchase items at whatever order you want, yay! I would aim for veils, backgrounds, and foregrounds first because those don't come by very often. Might be different for everyone, but I personally already have a ton of hair, shoes, and dresses, so I want to make up for items that I have little of first. So to break down of the stages, there are 5 stages each and you will get 3 attempts per stage. More attempts can be purchased at 10 diamonds per play. You get 5 oaf rings for winning and 3 oaf rings for losing. If you're free to play, that's 75 oaf rings per day if you win all your stages. There are 7 days to this event, so if you win everything every day, you will end up with 525 oaf rings, which unfortunately isn't enough to get any set. Uh. So if you're aiming for a particular set, you will have to spend. So right now I'm going to do a tutorial of each stages. I did end up getting S's for all of them. So I'm going to show you what I wore. First up is stage 1, Mysterious Girl. And I'm going to go inside, start styling. So this is the outfit I selected for this stage. The tip says comely girl next door, which doesn't really mean anything, and the proper style is lively and cute. The attributes for the stage is simple, lively, cute, pure, and cool, and as mentioned in the tips, it's lively and cute that will get you the most points. If you don't have these items, that's okay. Just focus on the items with the attributes I listed earlier. Especially with lively and cute at S or SS, and you should be able to get a good score. So this is stylist arena style. So I don't know. I'll probably pick gift immune. I might change this later because I'm picking gift immune over clock because gift immune protects you from docks and your anklets disappearing versus your shoes. I might change it back to sleeping later. So anyway, let's get dressed. There's the cute, pure, Simple, cool, and lively should have the most points. Yeah, it's okay. It would have been good if I landed the charming on lively, but you it's like arena style, so you don't get to choose which skills you use. It's all randomized. Okay, so the rank doesn't really matter. I don't know why they would show that. <laughs> okay, so I got five oaf rings for winning. Nice. And I'm gonna use all my free attempts here. So since you get three free attempts per stage, let me just choose an opponent and tap done one. Ooh, victory, yay. So that's another five of rings. Nice. Up next is stage two, intern wedding dress designer. So I'm gonna select my opponent and it looks like you can't really switch your opponent so i will go in and the tips for the stage is mature and sexy suit the proper style is mature and sexy all right i already picked out an outfit for the stage and these are the items that i use focus on the attributes simple lively mature sexy and cool it's mature and sexy that's going to get you the most points so make sure those attributes are as high a grade as possible for preferably s or ss so i'm gonna get dressed there's your lively not a lot of points there simple sexy mature and cool not a lot of points at cool too Awesome, 65k, so that is a win, and that's another 5 oaf rings. Again, why did they show the ranks? <laughs> we don't care about the ranks. <laughs> Alright, awesome. I'm gonna finish up my free attempt on stage 2 too. So search an opponent and tap done one. Done one basically uses my same outfit previously. Which I wanted, so cool. 
that's a victory there up next is stage three bumpy journey so i'm selecting an opponent and let's start styling i personally don't think the percent collection mean very much it just tells you the collection that they have not the actual score that they'll get Anyway, the tip here says beautiful and elegant evening dress. Ooh, so that definitely tells you that you need an evening dress tag right there to pass the stage. And the attributes are gorgeous, elegance, mature, sexy, and warm. As mentioned in the tips, you would need gorgeous and elegance at S or SS to get a good score. A is okay too. But yeah, this stage is pretty pay to win. <laughs> anyway, let's get dressed. There's the elegance. Sexy. Warm. Not a lot of points over at warmth. Mature. And gorgeous. Alright, wow. 111k. Hopefully with this score, I won't lose at all at this stage, so I'll probably end up repeating this stage non-stop. <laughs> we will see. Okay. Uh, there's the oath rings. Nice. Got five right there. And I'm just gonna finish up my free attempt right here on this stage. So just select any opponent and done one. Cool. That's a victory right there. And there's more offerings. Yay. Okay, up next is stage four. Sweet bride. Ooh, now we're getting to the wedding almost. <laughs> okay. Um the style is gorgeous Lilith style dress and the attributes are gorgeous and cute. So you know what Lilith style means, right? Lolicon! So focus on the Lolita tag here as you can see for my hair, for my dress, and for my coat. I have the Lolita tag. This will get you the most points. Also my shoes. I have a couple of Lolita items too. The hat and this necklace right here. And I have a couple more Lolita tags too. Okay, the gloves and the bag. Cool. Focus on the attributes. Gorgeous, lively, cute, pure, and warm. Because only those five attributes will get you points at this stage. Alright, I want to redo my skills. Because I noticed the gift immune wasn't really helpful. So I will end up doing sleeping. Alright. I am going to confirm and let's get dressed okay there's the warm pure cute dang i am clobbering her <laughs> gorgeous and lively wow i went up to 122k but then i think i was hit with that critical eye and now i'm 117k okay maybe i will focus on this stage <laughs> instead hopefully this will guarantee me winning <laughs> all right got the five of rings woohoo okay gonna finish up the free attempt here on stage four two Alrighty, just tap done one and victory cool Next is stage 5, the final stage, Secret Sorrow. So for the storyline of this stage, the girl, the girl that Nikki is helping, she was like, Oh, I actually don't want a Lilith style wedding like I did in stage 4. I actually want a Cloud style wedding. So you're here to help her at stage 5. So... The special tags are going to be Chinese Classical and Modern China and you want to focus on the attributes Simple, Elegance, Mature, Pure, and Warm. You will only get points for these 5 attributes and then focus on the attributes Simple and Pure as these will get you the most points. Okay, let us get dressed. There's warm, pure, 
elegant. Ooh. Simple. And mature. Wow. 121k points. Awesome. If this is confusing for you, there are excellent resources out there to recommend you items for you to get a better score. There's Nikki's Guide, Nikki's World, Nikki's Info, and there are recommendations posted up on Facebook and Reddit too. What I love about this community is that everyone is willing to help each other. Okay, so I'm gonna finish this. And I got my final free 5 offering right here so done all the free stages and i got 75 offerings in total and i'm gonna click in here and i can't buy anything oh wait i can buy that one at 74 right there but i'm gonna save it for now all right i hope this video was helpful best of luck on the event and remember to like comment and subscribe bye